All right, hello everyone and welcome back to Freaky Friday where today we're going to be taking a look at a little short horror game called One Night Too Many and basically we decided to stay an extra night in this beautiful hotel that we've been staying in and uh, apparently stuff gets a little bit hairy so let's get into it. Presenting print roll. Like I pressed enter, nothing happened. Other than loud music. Oh, oh there we go. Is that me coughing? I can see I had one too many, maybe. Um, ooh, I'm really fast. Whoa. Uh, I don't remember what the... Ooh. Oh, okay, you just walk over. Walter Smite, journal entry, 11th October, 1929. Well... That was some night. Shame it had to end in a <laughs> little fisticuffs. But oh well, staying back at the Grand Hotel is a nice cool off. I got plenty of bottle to lift my spirits tonight. Wasn't planning on staying a night extra, but after that shit show at the bar, you're damn right I'm gonna get pissed. Hell, not gonna let some small scuffle ruin a good time, am I? Hmm. No, I guess not. I guess you won't. Um, ooh, hello. So I can't open any of the doors or anything I don't believe okay door number 48 am I gonna need to remember that oh look at these busts oh I can kind of see into their rooms I don't I don't like that I guess it is 1929 you know stuff hasn't really developed yet do the monocle I'll call you professor Mick monocle okay hmm anything in these rooms no it doesn't look like it <sighs> Ooh. I don't know what was scary in 1929, I'll be honest. Um, currently, loud noises is a pretty good guess. I should stop running this way, shouldn't I? <laughs> I really feel like I should. Um, hmm. Okay, I understand that you're upset with me. And... I know it. I also left a lot of stuff in my hotel room. So I don't know if I should be leaving. But I'm going to anyway. <laughs> Look at this flower. Okay, here we go. Into the deep, dark hallway. 29? Like, oh. Hmm. Someone's playing the piano. Hmm. Oh. You were playing the piano. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. I, dis I disturbed you. Your your ghost was playing so eloquently on the old keys. It was really tickling the old ivories. Um. Uh, oh, abandon all hope. Okay, well, <laughs> don't have to tell me twice. Why do some rooms get it? Oh. Damn, this noise is unbearable. Those dodgy-looking men upstairs have made staying at this so-called grand hotel feel less grand and more like a dumpster fire. Can't wait to get out of here. Anyway, Mary just left you this note as I don't want to be heard complaining about you-know-who. Not worth the trouble. Yeah, sure. Um, why do some rooms have the upgraded piano package and others do not? That's what I want to know. Also, I don't know if I should be talking in my, like... 30s accent. Is that the sound of the doors opening? <laughs> so open the door. Hello, Walt. Hello. Don't call me Walt. Ooh. I just pick up. Hmm. I don't know. Kind of confused. Do you have any idea what I just picked up, Professor McMonagle? No. Okay. Uh. Ooh. Oh boy. Just can't feel good. Jane Roundhouse Diary, 11th October, 1929. That Walter guy keeps banging on about being paranoid about the windows. What a nut job. Needs to get his head sorted and stay the hell away from me and my family. Oh, I should probably do this in a women voice. And, uh, needs to get his head sorted and stay the hell away from me and my family. Oh, uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I wasn't very convincing. Kind of sound like the exact same thing, just higher pitch. Oh. Oh. 
What happened? <laughs> I didn't move because I haven't moved earlier. Was he behind me? I just didn't even see him. All right, sure, yeah. <laughs> I think I gotta just keep trudging on. Um, and just kind of ignore the noises, but also pay attention to where they are. I think there was a guy behind me, and that's what killed me. Or maybe it was one of the busts fell on me. And killed me. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure. Man, the doors really need to be oiled. Put some WD-40 on that. The moaning when they're opening up. Get rid of their moaning. Oh. Oh, there's a, there's a key. Oh! What room was that in? Ooh, I don't remember. Was it in this one? No. Uh, ooh, this one. Hello, Walt. Hello. Yeah, there it is. Okay. And now I'm guessing I have to run, sprint, and dodge any demons that come my way. Ooh, I don't know what's happening. He's playing the piano very loudly into my ear. Okay, I made it though. The lighting was a little strange. So, when I hear that run, hello, baggage carts, thank you for being in my way. I'm a little concerned about that man two floors above, seems to bring a lot of trouble and always seems to be drunk or off on something. Rumor is the guy's having hallucinations of recent. I'd be lying by stating that I ain't morbidly curious in what crazy sights he can encounter, but also scared shitless of what he may do as a result. Yeah, okay. Are all of these the same? Yeah, I think so. Why did I write that three times? Ooh. Hello. Oh my lordy Lou, what in the heck was that? <laughs> oh, what was that a clown? I I like barely even saw that. Um Hmm. Alright. We'll just continue on then. Back in, we didn't deserve this. Yeah, you're right. I is that all my viewers right now saying, oh, we, come on, we didn't deserve that cheap jump scare. That was completely uncalled for. You know what, I agree with you. I fully agree with you. Did I miss another key? Where was it? I didn't even, was it in that other room that the scary clown thing was in here? Oh gosh, I just heard my neighbors yelling, and I- Oh, there it is. Found the keys, dick. Now for the love of God, stop dropping them, you idiot. Yeah, come on, dick. You're being such a Richard right now. Ooh, I'm going the wrong way. Right? Nope, nope, I was going the right way. <laughs> oh. Oh boy. This is horrible. Oh! Run, 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 unlock, 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 unlock. Oh, I don't like it. Ooh, ooh, oh, oh, lordy. Did I? Okay, so I don't think I died because this is all different. Walter Smite, journal entry 12th October 1929. I swear I just heard gunshots. What, was it me that was getting shot with a gun? What in the actual fuck is going on? Good thing Andy brought his piece for times like this. How he was able to smuggle that thing with its oversized drum magazine, I will never know. But hey, beats reloading. Oh, uh, so he had a Tommy gun? Alright. I thought I could leave this life behind, but I guess Lady Luck made a deal with the devil as I am dragged back into this shit that I foolishly thought I could escape from. Okay. So I'm a mobster. Oh yeah, there's the atomic. Oh. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> okay. Oh, that 
that sent chills down my spine, I'll tell you that much. That was horrible. Actually horrible. Okay. Die, 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 die. Okay, is there any keys in here that I'm missing? No? Okay. Cool beans. I'm leaving now. With my Tommy gun. <laughs> oh. No, okay. We'll just keep running then. Oh, okay. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh, oh my gosh. This is horrible. Uh, kill them all, yeah. Planning on it. Note to self, keep key in this room from now on. Goddamn useless staff signed a pissed off inspector. Oh, yes. So keys are always in the room on the right, towards the end. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. Uh, stop your moaning. We all want to just leave, alright? Ooh. Ooh, okay. Back to normal. Okay. Oh my god. I don't know why those are so scary. I genuinely have no idea. It shouldn't be, right? Ooh, X? I warned you, but you had to push it, didn't you? It should serve as a reminder to anyone else. What is going on? I genuinely don't have any clue. <laughs> what is going on? Um. Okay. Oh, it's cleared now. What, was it cleared already? I think it might have been cleared already. Stop with the noises. Kill, 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 kill. Ooh, looking for something? Yes. Thank you. Thank you very much. Why are you oh. oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, 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 please. No, thank you. No, please. And thank you. Get out of here. Oh, gosh. My Tommy gun is gone. My- whoa, <laughs> what? My Tommy gun is gone. Um... Were these all of the people that I just shot? That were coming at me? Uh, oh no. This isn't good. <laughs> hey, come on, come on with your hands up. Okay. Ooh, hold on, I have to pee first. Never mind. Oh. This is some mobster. Crap. Hi. Officers. Walter knew was over at that point, and the part of him that remained principled and somewhat sane knew fine well that even if it wasn't his intention, the horrific acts that he committed should face justice. And that they did, for he was sentenced to death less than a year later. <laughs> so, those people were real? But, oh, I was the guy that was hallucinating. Oh, no, that's... That's not good. <laughs> Oh boy. So I, yeah, I was the one that was hallucinating. Saw them as ghosts and clowns or whatever and killed them all. Mm. Wow. <laughs> Here's your little mini Cooper for the day. <laughs> well, there we go, guys. That was one night too many. And wow. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that game, I don't know why it was so tense the entire time. I think just the, the process of it being like really loud to, you know, just the weird like stuff that just got you on edge, like the, uh, like, like the weird people that I was hallucinating with, the ghosts and everything that I was hallucinating with. I, I was just, that was terrifying. That was really, really kind of scary. Oh, but anyway, guys, I will leave that game in the description so you can try it out for yourself. Um, 
I think in the page uh, where I downloaded it, it said that there were two endings, so there might be a pacifist run to that uh, way to do it without killing those ghosts that were coming at you. I'm not entirely sure, um, but I mean, it would make sense seeing how you are hallucinating and you pick up the Tommy gun. Maybe there's a way that you can just go past them. Maybe if you don't pick up the Tommy gun or or something along those lines. So I will leave that for you guys to figure out. And um, yeah, I guess I'll see you in the next one. Bye.